There is a warning from the NYPD with less than two weeks until Election Day. A law enforcement bulletin now urging vigilance at polling sites. CBS 2's Alice Gaynor here now with more on this. Alice. Maurice and Christine, we want to stress there are no specific credible threats to candidates, polling sites, or workers in our area. But according to this bulletin, there's a lot of chatter online and generalized threats. CBS News has obtained a law enforcement bulletin by the NYPD. Violent extremists, particularly racially and ethnically motivated ones, as well as anti-government and anti-authority, continue to look at targets like political rallies, poll workers, and voting sites. So where does this intelligence come from? Hostile rhetoric in online forums, chat groups, and encrypted channels where false info circulates. Back in July, at a campaign event outside Rochester, Congressman Lee Zeldin, Republican candidate for governor, was attacked by a man but not injured. New York City has more than 1,000 public voting sites open from October 29th through November 8th. A lot of people say, oh, that's not going to happen here, but they have to prepare for it as if it's going to be a larger-than-life reality. Brian Boyd is a former Green Beret, an intelligence analyst and counterterrorism specialist who served in the Departments of Defense, Justice, and Treasury. He points to the January 6th riot on the Capitol. But they underreacted rather than to prepare for it. So what should we expect? The police will be there in their normal way. Some will be undercover, some will be in passive reserves, some will be in highly visible marked vehicles. But they are going to prepare for it the best they can. The average citizen just needs to be very, very aware, much like they would any other circumstance. And if you see something, report it. That's right. He says, pay attention to your surroundings. Now, the NYPD says again, there are no specific credible election related threats, but the alert is a reminder to remain vigilant during the ongoing midterm election season. The NYPD did not get into what exactly its security plans are. Maurice and Christine. Alice, thank you.